Welcome back to Maple Farms. Um, we got some more mineral feed here. That's going well. Whoops. Well, as well it is as it can go. Um, there we go. So, that's not exactly straight, but that's all right. Okay, uh, so what we're going to do, hang on, let me just stop for a second. Uh, so we're out of silage again. Um, we've got a bit of mineral feed in there, but I want to start preparing the next pen, uh, the next cow barn. And so we're going to start delivering a little bit over here. I kind of try to split it. Uh, we need uh, we we need a higher output, I guess, on the mineral feed. Um, that's all right. Okay, that's done. So um, so yeah. So what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna I'm gonna dump a few in there, and then we're gonna start uh, moving some silage over there. Uh, we have to stay on top of our silage hay game. Um, it's easy to get caught up in, in the field flipping and, and making money. But, you know, it's important to keep the cows going too, so. So, uh, what's the fastest way? Through here, I guess. I'm just going to grab those three that are ready here. We'll deliver those. We'll get on to some other things. We have a big beet harvest to do. I think probably though we're gonna rest before we uh, we move to that. So, um, yeah, how are you guys doing today? I was uh, editing the previous video, which you should see very soon, and I noticed that I had a really kind of a oh, such a sad day kind of voice. Um, yeah, I don't know what was wrong, but anyways, I get up as ups and downs, I guess. Oops. Yeah, there we go. Okay, this forklift is fine uh, as long as I try to not not try to do anything too fancy with it. But let me drop this off. Then we're gonna take a break. Uh, we'll rest up because we got some big things coming. I don't know how much money we're gonna make from that sugar beet harvest, but it's not a it's not a small field. It's not a super big field either. Um, we should, you know, we're just gonna sell that right away. It's the time to sell it. Oh. All right. Let's uh, let's go park this and we'll we'll rest. It's amazing how fast this thing goes. I love it. <laughs> I'm just going to park over here. I wonder how Doggo's doing. My yard car. Um, hey, pup. There you go. You don't have any food. There you go. Eat, eat. Okay. All right, guys, let's, uh, let's have a rest. Ooh, got some leasing costs there. We got a bit of snow. I, uh, I hope it doesn't accumulate. Um, that's kind of weird. Look at that. Not snowing here. It is snowing here. What is with my computer? Snowing over there, though. Oh, well, there we go. Now it's snowing on me. Okay, so strange. So strange. Um, all right. So, oh boy, we got a whole bunch more to deal with this morning. How are we doing for let's have a look um we'll look from the from the menu so we are getting low on canola so i gotta find a source for canola real soon and the way that we've been rolling it's likely going to be a field purchase uh harvest and flip and uh, we'll take all the canola and dump it in here um wheat uh we still got lots so it's really a canola thing and okay and then here, uh, we're going to need to put in some 
um, some more grass in here. So I, I want to move to chaff at some point. Um, but yeah, one thing at a time, I guess. All right, let's lease ourselves a beet harvester. Uh, actually, now that I think of it, I cannot harvest while it's snowing, can I? I mean, I can, but I'll take a hit. I don't want to do that. Um, weather, weather. Snow until all day. Uh oh. Oh no. And February looks like snow as well. And rain in March. Eh. That's not great. That's a problem. That's a real problem. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what to do really. Uh, we wait to harvest, we're going to lose the price. Mm. Guys, what am I doing? Okay. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I don't know how we're going to deal with this. The lazy part in me says sell the field. Just sell it and uh, worry about worry about what we're going to do. I mean, at the end of the day, we can't harvest anything. Guys. Um, you can't mow. Well, I think you can mow. I think I, somebody told me that, that you can mow. Give me a minute. I gotta figure out what we're gonna do. I did not expect this. Okay, as I was poking around trying to figure it out what I was gonna be doing, I came to realize that this uh, worker here had stopped and did not finish uh, planting the grass. Drilling in the grass. So I have some grass that's growing and some nothing. So we've set them off. Um, Let's look at the sale and see if there's anything interesting. Nothing. And I'm... Yeah. I am, uh... Yeah, I'm a little, uh... A little perplexed. All day. It's supposed to snow. Okay, well, we're gonna do a couple of things. Um... I have this roller here. It was here part of, um... It was part of the initial purchase, um, you know, with the new farmer mode. And I tried to run it, um, and it didn't work very well. Um, I could not get it to roll properly. So, I don't know, maybe I'm doing something wrong. I'm probably doing something wrong. You guys know me. Um, kind of thinking of selling it. I find rolling it to be... Uh, uh, not worthwhile. Um, I mean, it increases your le yield just a little bit, but when you have grass fields everywhere, uh, more than you can keep up with, I don't, you know, see the value really. So why don't we go just go sell that? Uh, at least, very least, get it out of the way. Oh, I ran over the dog again. That dog, though. We do have some money, so maybe we'll do a little field shopping. Uh, try to figure out what we can what we can buy. Uh, perhaps the flip or keep. Might as well, let's move up the time a bit. Can't hurt really. Actually, let's get let's get it a little brighter. There's snow that's accumulating in some spots. Interesting. Okay, let's slow that back down a bit. I don't know what that's worth, not much, but let's get it out of the yard. Okay. 
All right, let's have a look and see. Uh, I want to see for a second. I want to see which uh, which things are best at certain times of the year. So wheat is January. Barley is January as well. Oats is January. Uh, canola is November. January. Uh, May is grapes and olives. I don't think we're going to be doing that on this map. Uh, sunflower is March. Ooh. Let's see if we can find ourselves a March uh, sunflower field that we can buy. I uh, don't have a header for it. Um, corn is July. Potatoes and beets. What else we have in here? Cotton is March. Oh, cotton. We could lease a harvester for that. Sugar cane is July and not touching that. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Confusing. Snow starting to accumulate. So let's have a look at fields. Uh, what do we have? We said cotton and sunflower, perhaps. Um... What about 33 here is ready. That's sunflower. I mean, it's okay. We can wait to harvest it. Uh, we're just going to have to find a window to do it in. That's a big field. What's it? What does that go for? 97. Yeah, why don't we do that? We'll buy it and flip it. We'll, we'll do our regular routine. And then... There is zero cotton on this map. None, absolutely none. Um, what about 99, what does that look like? Uh, no, not good. Hmm. Okay. I think we're going to stick with, uh, what's ready here? Three, what is that? That is, that's also sunflower. Okay, hang on a second here. And it's ready. How much is this? Can I afford it? 121, I cannot afford it. Okay, well, unless I sell the sugar beet field. Yeah, let's do that. We're going to sell the sugar beet field. You cannot sell this land while you own placeable objects on it. What? I don't have objects on here. So confused, guys. So confused. Um, okay. It's that kind of an episode. It's that kind of an episode. Um, I don't know what I could possibly have on that field. Let's head back there. I want to go have a look and see if there's something. I think I, I'm starting to feel like maybe there's something wrong with my with my uh, computer setup. I may have to reinstall uh, Farm Sim or get rid of all the mods and start fresh or something. I don't know. That's such weird things. Like, look at this snow. What 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 is that? Why is that like that? I, I live in Canada. Snow doesn't fall like that in in blocks. Um, okay, so I bought this field, no problem. I bought it. Um, let's. Oh, there's a baler. Just popped up. Uh, what could I possibly have to sell on this field? There's nothing. I wonder if it's because this is a cow pen and it's somehow encroaching, I guess. Um, yeah, I don't get it. This game is so much fun. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, so we're going to tough it out. That's our field now. 
Um, we're gonna miss the window to sell the sugar beet, but we'll sell it anyway. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, there's nothing really to do today. Uh, short of taking care of more animals. Still got plenty of food. Everybody's well fed. Um, let's... The dog... What's the dog doing? Climbing on the stuff. Weird dog. Okay, this is finished. Strangely. The way it did it. It is strangely done. Okay, let's leave this here. Snow's accumulating everywhere. It's time to go in and sit by the fire. Teleport it around a little bit there. Um, yeah, January's a write-off. Yes, farm life. Okay. What is our status here? Uh, snow's still coming down. But it looks like we're going to get a break. Let's look at the forecast. Uh, we have snow breaking at 3 this afternoon uh, for, yeah, for the rest of the day kind of thing. So we're probably going to fast forward. Uh, hopefully the snow comes off the ground. And um, our money is dropped quite a bit uh, in leasing so okay all right guys uh, I'm gonna fast forward okay we're gonna slow that down right quite a bit now uh, still snow on the ground there's gonna be snow on the field but at least it's not snowing uh, I've noticed that we've skipped so much time that food is starting to get low again um, so we're gonna have to we're gonna have to deal with that uh, real soon. It's gonna be difficult with all, all the snow on the ground. Um, yeah, it'll be a challenge. Actually, let's look at. I just want to look at something else before we get going. Um, so we don't have reproduction yet. Uh, we do have a fair amount of slurry. Well, a fair amount. It doesn't go very far. Uh, these guys are doing well. Uh, cleanliness, fitness, daily riding, nothing today. That's fine. Um, they're doing well. So the prices are starting to come up on those. And our chickens are uh, doing very well. They're all good. Okay. Apparently there's, yeah, okay. All right, so let's get going on the sugar beet harvest. No special deals. <laughs> Salt spreading unit. Uh, interesting. Uh, can you spread salt on the field? All right. Uh, sugar beet. Uh, we are going to go. We're going to be leasing again. And uh, I could go with this. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Um, I think we're going to go with... Uh, this has a, what's the capacity on this? 45, that's 30. It will go big. And we're just going to lease that. Do I have enough money? Yes, I do. All right. Lease. 24,000. Let's go pick that up. Oh, that does not corner very well. Need beacons for sure. Oh, man. Perhaps if I drive from the driver's seat, that will go a lot better. See the see those little displays there that show the sugar beet on the ground? Looks like it's fake. They're probably the stickers, the factory stickers. You got to take them off the off the screen. All right. What's going on here? Oh boy.
I just ran over somebody. Okay, this could be interesting. We'll see how this goes. I guess this is our field to keep for sure. Alright, we're gonna start right here, I think. And I'm gonna do many headlands. Uh, we'll probably do six, seven. See what that looks like. Yeah, that should be safe. Uh, this thing does not turn, so we got to get well away from the uh, the hedges, and uh, this might actually still even be a problem, but we'll see. And I want to also set, um, do the settings. I oh, don't need that. I don't need that folded. I'm gonna stop, and I'm not gonna do self unload. Okay. Go. I set it to smooth because cornering is gonna be. I mean, we're gonna miss some. That's okay. That's okay. It's actually not usually terrible. Um, this harvester tends to do pretty well uh, as long as you set it to smooth. All right, we need a trailer. Uh, what size trailer do we own? I feel like it might be a bit small. I would like to unload, do, you know, one full unload kind of thing. Yeah, let's look at the price. I want to see if it has dropped much. Uh, actually, February might not be so bad. Uh, 447. And we got 436 at supermarket. Don't know where that is. Let's find out where's supermarket. Where is it? I don't see it. There it is. Uh, right over here. Okay. Okay, that's a bit of a drive, but that's okay. That's fine. And then if we look at our uh, trailer, what is that? That is 34, so that's not a full load. It's only worth 660. Oh, geez. Um, challenges, challenges, uh, what is that? That is 37. I'd like a 45. That's what I'm looking for. 40, 45, that is six. I don't have enough money for it. Yeah, boy. Okay. We'll have to make do with what we have. I think I really wish there was a filter on, um, the shop where you could, you know, do a checkbox or something that says, show me what I can afford. Uh, <laughs> save a lot of, uh, a lot of time searching. So we're going to be doing a lot of runs. I think, um, we'll do a lot of it off camera. Actually, this is not that big of a field. What are we at? 33%. Yeah, I think we're, it's not going to be that bad, actually. All right, what else can we do while we're waiting for this? Uh, okay, so our other fields, uh, this is also ready. So we could start this harvest as well, but I only have one trailer. That's kind of the problem. Uh, this field over here, oats as well, is ready. And I suspect that these two uh, grass fields are probably ready as well. So lots to do. It's just hard to do when you can't see the field properly. Um, yeah. Why is he... Okay. So he's at 18,000. We can keep an eye on that. As soon as it's uh, 34, we can go and upload. No, nope, don't have to wait for him to, to be uh, completely full. I'm going to hold off on the other harvesting for now. I don't know how well.
well this skid steer, or not skid steer, this uh, forklift is going to work in the snow, but... Can't even see the dog dish. I guess I could, well, yeah, this is, uh, maybe it's not a wise idea either. All right, we're at 34,000 in the harvester. I'm just gonna wait for them to come around. And we'll unload and go deliver our first load. I wanna see what we're gonna get for this. I mean, I kinda know what it's gonna be. It's gonna probably gonna be about 16, 15 to 16,000. Get closer. Get closer. All right. Let's get out of here. Now, two full loads will um, basically offset the, the leasing costs. Everything after that is pure profit. Uh, we won't be putting sugar beet back in there. We're gonna put uh, we're gonna put something else. Now I'm not quite sure what's the best route to take to get there, and shouldn't be doing distracted driving. I think there's a there's a real kind of main road uh, up here. Yeah. Okay, where are we? A little bit further. There we are. Grocery Mart. Uh, how do I get in there? Oh, that's a tight corner. Okay. We go. Are we spinning? No. Over here. There we go. Where does that road go? A little bit less than I thought. That's okay. Whoa! I thought I could go around. I am wrong. By the time we get back, we're going to be almost at 34,000 again. So I think we're going to be playing that game uh, constant, non stop delivering. Um, this is where I live. Yes. All right. Where are we at? We are at 30,000. I'm just going to wait till he's at 34. Um, I want to play the stop and go game. Doing a good job though. Pretty happy with it. Not bad though. We're probably looking at about five, I want to say five or six loads though. So, yeah, that'll be good. It'll be profitable for sure. Well, this field over here is ours and. Um, yeah, it looks good. Looks good. I'm trying to figure out where you get into it. Not quite sure.
Yeah, I'm not quite sure where you get into that. But I was just looking at the... Um, yeah, I was just looking at the map. Uh, this is our field now. We gotta keep it, because we can't apparently sell it. Um, and then there's all these trees here, and a hedge, and this is our field as well. So I'm considering the idea of processing all these trees, uh, removing the hedge, and then merging these two into one big field. And I think we're going to probably do that. Uh, I do not, this is, will not work with a tree harvester, I don't think. So, uh, I certainly don't want to do all this manually. Um, each one of those branches, I think, needs to come off separately. I'm not sure. I'm not 100% sure. We can test one, actually. Why not, right? I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Fell on me. Okay, we're cheating a bit. Yeah, each one of those limbs uh, has to come off and be processed separately. Which is, in a way, yeah, I'm not doing that. Um, so I think what we'll do is we might try to find a, um, I know there's a, a mod that does wood chipping of trees while they're standing. Um, I might look into that. We'll wood chip the whole thing and sell all that and we can even wood chip the, the hedge. Um, yeah, that might be a, that might be a project. Uh, this one, yeah, it's just going to sit there. Is it in the way? No. Okay. Alright, we are 34 again. Let's get back in here. I think to catch him before he turns the corner. There we go. Perfect. All right, third load, and the um, we've covered our, our leasing costs now, so everything now is just pure, pure profit. I am going to try this. I'm curious. I want to see where this goes. go this way we're gonna go up here I have a feeling that's not much of a shortcut I just took Okay, where are we at? We are only at 9,000, so... I can tell that we're now into these small passes. Let's have a look at... Um, our forestry products. Now, there's some here that will just destroy the trees, which I could do. Um, but I'd prefer to try to get some money out of it if we can. Um, where is it? I've seen it in here somewhere. This guy. So, uh, this has a capacity. No capacity, capacity. And real versus unreal. 
Oh, at a hundred thousand. Holy smokes. Yeah, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe we're just going to get rid of them. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. What about actual, um, are there machines that do that? This will actually just destroy, which I could do. Tree be gone's a lot cheaper though. Let's just destroy them. I think we're just gonna go ahead and destroy them. Um, no role play in this one. So I'm just gonna lease that. Don't need to keep it. And while we're waiting for this guy, uh, we'll get to work on that. Well, snow's off the ground now, so that's good. I don't, I didn't notice when that switched. I'm going to do something that some of you guys are going to cringe at, but that's all right. We're going to open up the farm. We're going to open up the fields. We're going to get rid of a lot of hedges while we have this. And um, it will reduce my driving anxiety. Why did it go that way? Oh boy. Guess I'm getting a weight too. Uh, do I have a weight? I don't know if I actually own one. I do somewhere. Let's just pick up another one. A really heavy one, I guess. Um, da -da -da. What is that? Uh, two and a half tons. Um, how about this guy? That might be enough. Uh, lease. 76 bucks. It should do it, I would think. Okay, I think we're good. This might actually be really good for dealing with traffic. Ooh. I'll turn it on. I want to shred a car. <laughs> I won't be that guy. Maybe. Where are we at? We're at 24,000. We still have to wait a bit more. All right, let's get to work. Yeah, that's what I said I was going to do. The environmentalists are going to be after me. Okay, now that field is not mine. So I should not touch that, lest I get in trouble. And we have more than 34,000, so I'm going to take a break from this.
This is so much fun though. And take out this hedge here. Sort of visibility. I'm not going to touch that tree. Okay. That's entirely too much fun. Let's get back to destroying stuff. Okay, almost done with this stretch here. We're at 31,000. And the harvester. We're gonna plow that up. And then we will, uh, once we harvest that field, we'll join the two fields and we'll make one nice big field. That said, I am going to continue with some of this work. Well, I'm already at 34,000. Uh, yeah, let's leave it here for now. This should be, there should be one more load after this. Well, I don't think I'm going to turn around in time. And when you destroy trees instead of harvesting them, uh, visually they still kind of show up um, in the distance. When you're close, you don't see them, but if you're in distance, um, they still show up. It's until you do, uh, until you leave the game and come back in. Uh, do they do a full visual reset? All right. Um, yeah, it might be more than one load. Oh well. Um, there we go. I know. Stop cringing. I'm doing it. Uh, you're probably wondering why I'm doing this. Um, I am doing this to uh, improve the ability of workers to work on my fields. I know, I know that you would never do this in real life, but as it says in the description, um, no role playing in this series at all. We're going to be just getting some breathing room because that's the way I roll. All right. There's still lots to do. I'm going to be hanging on to this for a bit. Um, I'm just going to get more and more breathing room. I I don't like I don't, <laughs> I don't like the congestion. <laughs> I'm mean, being completely honest here. I find it a little annoying. It's all right, though. Um, you know, like a lot of this stuff here, it's ambiance for sure. I mean, I get it. Um, it's got some values in real life. Okay. Apparently we're finished, but doesn't look like we actually are. Let's get this strip at least. Of course, there's just a bit more than one load. All right, guys, um, that's going to be it for this episode. I am going to go ahead and deliver the rest of the sugar beet. Uh, I'll have to come back, pick up another small load. I will 
uh, then return uh, the least equipment. I'm going to keep the tree be gone. We're going to do some more cleaning up. You guys will see a lot more open space in the future. And, uh, and we're going to leave it at that. So uh, thanks a lot for watching. I hope you're enjoying this series. Uh, if you are, please consider subscribing. And I wish you a great day.